Okay, so it's a uh, Wednesday, I think, July 11th. Um, it's only Wednesday. It's uh, around four or five, so vendor cars might be starting up soon. Um, here's that water level that I came up with, but the nozzle is not the best, and um, Moringa's doing well. So is the other stuff. I got a little bit of cactus, Puntia. These I pruned back hard and they're doing well. These I got to cover in gloss coats so they don't scrape because this the paint scrapes off too easy. <sighs> Isn't that funny? Anyway, the backpack uh, got torn up. I need to uh, come up with a, I don't know, maybe find one online or something. I think I understand the principle, but it would be better not to play trial and error with it um, and make a, what do they call those, uh, those, those packs that you strap to your forehead, basically. Uh, they put the weight on, on your head uh, instead of your back. Um, I think they're called temps or, or something. Um, they use them in, in, the, uh, in the Himalayas uh, to carry stuff up, um, notably. Anyway, I covered this in cardboard due to the sun. Cardboard takes so much longer to decompose than plastic. Uh, you can already tell the plastic is deteriorating bad. That was used to cover that while I sorted through it because uh, it's recyclable. Um, more cardboard I found in the park. Some glass I found in the park. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go out there, but I don't want to be uh, talking, so uh, I'll cover a few main things and I'll interject with stuff if I need to bring them up. Oh, yeah, this broke in the washer. Um, I want to make a like a spaced out like two parallel rows of wall with foundation along the fence line, a walkway. Um, maybe uh, maybe uh, yeah, a walkway. Uh, it's great. The dogs just. The dogs haven't been barking all day, and now all of a sudden... <sighs> right. Puppet... Thuggers? Anyway. Um, the grease, or whatever, stopped the uh, creaking of the seesaw, so now... I don't know how many... Like, a block at least. A block or two, at least. Has, uh that element missing that was chronic as far as I could tell taking care of laundry that's dry that's not yet uh, got like 24 at least chili peppers ready They're growing pollinated what else? What else? What else? Gonna fertilize. I don't know if the cactus or the, uh, the fig or the ficus. I mean, are you fucking kidding? Do you hear this shit? Do you hear this shit? tree I cut down because it was confirmed dead. Uh, I still haven't gotten the pine cones that I asked for. Uh, it's a neighbor's cat. She's well taken care of. It's, she's nice. She got to meet the cat that I was taking care of before it was st stolen basically. 
Um, he walked out this way or somebody came in here and just took him. I gotta figure out what to do with that. Oh my fucking god. This is taking up my fucking recording time. Anyway, the dragon fruit is doing well. Um, the worm bin is doing pretty well. Not bad, at least. Uh, that pineapple might grow. Oh my fucking god. It just had to overlap right now, huh? Alright, what else? Uh, yeah, the walkway, the wall. Um, I'm thinking uh, swales that are like terraces, kinda. They didn't stop up at the top. <sighs> anyway, um, next, 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 next. Yeah, mainly, mainly the wall thing, and then checking up on the trees out there. So. I guess here, here goes. Cake and eat it too, assholes. Come on. Oh, today, as a today as a reminder, for everything that uh, keeps getting lost over, I put a knife right here. Still a little red from it. I pushed. I pushed, and I couldn't feel anything. You know, doing a favor for. This tree was the one. I'll show you the hole that it was got taken out of. That uh, it's recovering. I don't know what happened with it. It was doing fine for a while, and then all of a sudden it took a turn for the worse. Worm tea. It's, oh, some seedlings. Some macadamia seedlings. Macadamia seedlings. Um. This seems aerobic still, so, but I'll mix it anyway. Got some room. The hose makes it up to around there. I put it in right there. 
I put it in a bucket, throw a brick on top of it, because that leaks. The junction right there is really bad. And it leaks. And then I attach that one. And it makes it all the way out to where I've been putting the buckets as far as spraying reach with that attached. Otherwise, it's just buckets for now. Apple tree is doing well. See if anyone's messed with us further. They broke off that right there. Or that right there. No new growth visible there. I've been watering this pretty regularly, so the lamb's quarters that you're gonna see over by where the pond used to be, they're in similar shape. I think it's just the season. New growth. New growth. That was already there. Oh. 
I cut this grass back, it seems to be doing really well. I like that it has deep roots. Same with the mustard. It looks like there's more uh, lamb's quarter there, so maybe if I just cut it back down and then let the seed and then regrow, it'll do fine. That's weird. I cut that off last night. I didn't break it off. That looks partly splintered. I don't like how they messed with the soil here. I had it uh, figured out already to where I knew where the water would go. And now it doesn't go where I planned on it going. See? It pulls up instead of spreading out to where I wanted it to. So those are those are getting less of a share than I planned on them getting. And these are getting more of a share than I planned on them getting. Even though these grow less edible stuff than those. This has been messed with too, several times. It used to be able to hold two whole uh, five gallon buckets without doing what it's doing right now. And uh, those used to be much more fixed where I put them, they were less likely to get in anybody's way of stepping, they were less likely to roll around or fall off. And now whoever replaced them, apparently whoever replaced them has more 
respect from whoever moved them the first time around because I could easily just go and you wouldn't be able to do that with the ones before. Same with how those aren't messed with. Again, reminder of the trash being emptied regularly and the ground swept up here. That's where the tree got taken out of, because it was doing poorly. Those are doing better, even in the condition they're in. Even this one holds almost a full five gallon bucket, despite how much it's been messed with right there. But that's been mostly the dogs and cats. Thinking the path should be from wherever the fence is closed right there, past the tree line of the acacias, and between those two benches right there, down to the sidewalk. The uh, gazebo thing needs a uh, retaining wall, because the hillside is eroding right there. Cats are still using this as a litter box. It looks like maybe the dogs are too. Which is better than me going anywhere and everywhere else. So yeah, it sucks because the water now pools up right there and a lot of plant roots and uh, organic matter that I had been comfortable with being there got removed and torn up probably with that rock or concrete chunk right there. The uh, pepper tree right there seems to be benefiting from the watering that I'm doing here despite them being invasive. I don't know how many of the pepper and um, eucalyptus trees I would like to remain, considering they're invasive and considering they may have caught something. And uh, they drain all the moisture from the other trees. This place was empty when I decided to come out here.
so yeah. You saw the fence line, you saw how everything sloped, there's no terraces. The kids or their puppet masters like throwing rocks via proxy. I still haven't cleared the gravel around there. Now that I don't have spoiled groceries over there, I could do that. White fly. See the little guy there? Still have plans to uh, treat or give the neighbors some treatment for the uh, white fly that they have on their. Uh, I think it's a camellia. I think they have camellias. Um, but that's been held up. The cat and the dog thing happened, and I don't even have a pet cat or dog companion to uh, show for the care that I took. And the assholes are still at it, right now, as I speak. Anyway, uh, that's that for now, I guess. I gotta hang up this clothes and eat something.